As Nigerians join the rest of the world to mark the 2024 Easter celebration, Christians faithful across the nation are urged to imbibe the spirit of love and compassion for one another, just as Jesus Christ demonstrated and gave up his life for the salvation of many. In a way, the Imo State Capital, the celebration despite the hardship in the economy is being done by Christian families who trooped out to worship centers in a bid to observe the Good Friday. Saturday. Today is Good Friday, the day we commemorate the crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. So that's what we are celebrating today, a commemoration, a remembrance of that suffering he passed through and his death, which brought our salvation. So Good Friday actually is one of the special days in the Holy Week. In fact, it's among the three do. The three do is from Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. It reminds us about the death and crucifixion, the crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. You know, the way he went on the cross to suffer, die for our sake, and uh, we're expecting that by Easter, he will resurrect, you know, for our glory. Today is a special day. What we are doing is to commemorate the crucifixion and the death of our Lord Jesus Christ. This means a lot to Christians across the world. Speaking further, some respondents said the sacrifices paid by Jesus Christ should not be a waste. They advise all those still living in sin to consider a change of attitude and embrace the teachings and the lifestyle of Jesus Christ wherever they find themselves. I believe that through this uh, uh, Easter Tridu, many of us, those in the government house and the other places, we, they will found it somehow with all their evil activities or with all the evil things that they have been doing. And I believe that uh, through this uh, uh, resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, which we celebrate on this Easter Sunday, they will be able to change. What we are remembering is the death of Christ, and the death of Christ brought us salvation. My message to the world and to Nigeria at large is for them to embrace this salvation that Christ has brought. According to the scripture as stated in the Holy Bible, it is clear that Jesus Christ died that we, the Christian faithful, may live. He paid the supreme price for our sins, and as many that believe in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. This is the hope of many Christians faithful, and no matter the present day difficulties, there is hope of a better life with the Lord when they transcend to the world beyond.